My name is Joe Wentworth, Senior Product Manager at Peerless AV, and today we're going to take you through our new SR860 Universal Mobile Cart. The installation for the 860 cart is pretty straightforward. Once you have the parts unpacked, the first thing you're going to do is take the upper frame and the lower legs and secure those together. So you'll take the um, right leg of the cart and you will run the uh, end of the power cord um, through this leg. Um, this is pre-installed at the factory. It comes with the cart. So you'll run it through the end of the leg. Out through the exit on it. And then run your leg um, up onto the cart itself. You'll use the flathead Allen screws to secure the two legs together. So once one leg is complete, you'll do exactly the same thing with the other side. Slide the leg into place. Once your two legs are assembled, then you move on to the caster assembly. And we provide two different types of casters. Um, two of them have brakes that would be installed on the front of the cart. So you're gonna install the uh, casters onto the bottom of the cart. These just thread into place. And the caster with the brake. And then you'll install the two other casters and then your second caster with the brake. Once the caster's installed, you can move the cart to your floor. All right, so the next step, we'll go ahead and install the shelf. Make sure your cable is pulled out through that opening. We're going to wrap the cord up in here. So wrapping that cord up is going to help with the installation of the upper shelf. So this will be secured with four bolts. Two on the front. And then the two rear bolts, you'll use the bumpers that come with it. And that completes your shelf with your cable wrap. All right, so the next step will be installing these two brackets on the cart. So you're gonna install the brackets onto these holes in the side of the cart. Where you install them affects where your display is gonna be placed. So you'll install one on one side of the cart, and then you'll install the other at the matching hole. Make sure these are loose enough because the next step you're gonna hook and hang the adapter bracket onto these screw heads. So those need to be loosened up just a little bit. So you take your adapter plate and this is just a simple hook and hang onto those brackets. And with your two remaining screws, you're going to level out your wall plate and you're gonna run your screw uh, into these bottom holes on both sides. Okay. 
Once those are installed, you can go ahead and tighten everything down. You do have a plumb adjust that's built into here that helps um, for any sag from that display. It helps you adjust that to make sure your uh, display is nice and level. The next step you would have is you would take the adapter brackets and uh, mount these to the back of your display. Um, that would then be mounted and then you'll hook and hang your display onto the wall plate of the cart. So the last portion, you're going to install the cover onto the back of the cart. And that is the completed assembly of the SR-860.